Hey, what's going on guys? It's Sword Daz here. Today I want to talk about another way to practice. This is going to be a really short video or I'll try to keep it short, but this is a technique that is used by a lot of pro players. I've seen a lot of Overwatch players do it and obviously it goes back to even the days of Counter-Strike when people used to just turn off the HUD and just put a piece of like tape in the center of the screen just to memorize where the center of the screen was. But this can help you immensely. It's simple, but in the long run, it's nice to get you back to basics, which is why I'm going to talk about it today. And also somebody in the comment section reminded it to me. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I need to make a video on this to remind people of it. So back in Battlefield 1, I did for three weeks straight with no HUD and no crosshairs. And it taught me a lot and it gets you back to basics. It's a simple aiming tip is to practice your crosshair placement, meaning you are not looking too far up, too far down. And you're making as minimal movement as possible to get you to the right spot of where your enemy target is. So if your target is running across head level, you want to have your crosshairs at what would be considered head level rather than having to adjust their shot even further. It saves you that short amount of time and everything adds up whenever you have these short engagements. Essentially, you're setting yourself up for success. Now, with no crosshair, no HUD, these are the things you are training. They're common sense again, yes, but you gotta train them. No HUD helps you pay more attention to sound and your overall environment. When no crosshair is added, then of course, then you're focusing on the middle of your screen a lot more and less on the crosshairs physically. Not to go down a rabbit hole, but there's a debate if it's better that you look at your crosshairs while you aim or you better if you look at the target. Now it's argued both ways. I personally aim without looking at the crosshairs and I look at my target. My theory is if I'm looking at the crosshairs, I'm gonna adjust my arm or aim to the crosshairs. If I'm aiming what I see, then obviously I'm gonna to adjust to what I'm seeing. Also, when you do a quick shot, you're not even looking at your crosshairs. You're looking at where the target is going to possibly be, and you're just making a quick movement based on muscle memory. So, turn off your crosshairs and practice placements. This can be done in any game. If you're doing an Overwatch, there's lobbies in Overwatch where you can play without your crosshairs on and everyone just kind of shoots around with Widowmaker. You can do it in Battlefield 5, turning off your HUD. You can do it in Kovacs, just memorize the center of your screen. There's so many different games where you can just turn off the HUD and just essentially practice and get back to basics. So again, focus on everything else. And remember when we talked about the 24 Hertz thing? The idea is not to focus on just one thing of your aim. The aspect is to focus on everything. Everything with your aim is important, and I hope that this small thing helped you improve. If you found this video helpful, let me know. I know it helped me. It is tough, but personally it did teach me a lot. So give it a whirl, give it a try, and let me know what your thoughts are, because again, something like this really did help me after doing hours and hours of gaming. Thank you again so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.